germs can definitely enter the brain from the outside. Now, how will they get there? I would suggest three main highways. Number one is your bloodstream. So an infection anywhere in your body could be carried by your blood up to the brain and the germs could multiply up there. But there are two other pathways to the brain that are less frequently recognized. One is your nose. The second is your eye. Both of these connect directly to the brain. And therefore, it's possible that a virus or bacteria in your eye or nose could travel up the nerve into your brain. So that gives us three major highways by which things can enter your brain without your skull even being broken. 